Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, happy times on everybody. This is the Road to Dusk. You can call me Road Dusk, anything that you would call a friend. I am a dream usher, so I focus on sleep, dreams, and the imagination to help create an environment where people can be better versions of themselves. Oh, did my transition not work there? Because I... I was too ballsy. Sorry, I'm wanting to double check on a few things to make sure that things are up and running as they should. Yes, okay. Everything is good to go. <laughs> Alright, so obviously with tonight we do have another short stream. Hey Zelda, hope you're doing well. And ye, takes handsome or no handsome. Let me turn off the music here. Let me have it to where I can hear people. Let me be sure that the... Oh, I need to be sure that the game isn't too loud. That might be why it was just destroying my eardrums. Here we go. Let's migrate over. Let's not waste any time. Uh, yeah. Really hope that everyone's been doing well. For those that do not know, we... Sorry, I wanted to try and be sure that people can like hear the game and such. Yeah, for those that do not know, uh, we had started Kingdom Hearts 2 last week and semi-speed ran through Roxas' story in order to get to Sora here. Considering, it, like, like last week, we only have two hours today for streaming. Gotta love capitalism and shit for that. <laughs> but we are making the most of it. Plus, given that this is a comfort game for my system and I, I hold absolutely no qualms. Hold on, let me do that. Do do do. Oh, I never noticed that they that this is kind of a revamp. Frankly, all the songs in this are kind of revamped. I'm just so used to the uh, PlayStation 2 versions. I'm just used to PlayStation 2 everything, especially for Kingdom Hearts. So, yay. Make of that what you will. Also, I actually want to double check a thing. I want to be sure that uh, my... Captions plugin is still. Yes. Good. Good, good, good. Oh. Oh, why is. Okay. Why is. Hold on. My thing is one. Just. Not letting me. There we go. Took it long enough. Okay. Now let's beat us some shit. Yes, while I know that Kingdom Hearts 2. Look, actually, all the Kingdom Hearts series, save for the mobile games, obviously, but they're being ported to Steam, which, while I am excited for. I don't know if I want to have it as an option on my computer. I already have my games on PS2. I already have my games here on PS4. Why would I want to fork um, full price revamped games for a third time? Well, rather, second time for a revamp, rather. When I already have the original and arguably currently the most popular way to play Kingdom Hearts, and that's through PlayStation 4. Like, sure, the Steam port will be amazing for modders, and will make certain mod projects, like, um... I forget the specific name of it, but someone has... Some folks have been working on a mod project related to having basically a complete play of Kingdom Hearts 3, 5, 8 days over 2, but in Kingdom Hearts 2's engine. So while I am excited to see that come to fruition, 
at the same time, I'm not sure what else could be done uh, when Kingdom Hearts gets migrated to Steam and be accessible on PC. Because it's not like people haven't ripped the models before and made random shit. I mean, look at the look at the Mika Mika Dance community. That shit has been ahead of the game when it comes to mods and fanfiction writers alike for years. <laughs> But regardless, still happy all the same that folks will be able to play the Kingdom Hearts series on multiple platforms. Because I know this is a very much a departure from what Sony normally does, as for the longest time, Kingdom Hearts has only been a PlayStation Sony series. We were lucky to get the, say, mobile games, but, like, their core games except for like the 3DS game, uh, except the, the DS games, were PlayStation hey exclusive. Show, show some respect. So, you are Sora. Now then, have you seen the king yet? Oh, I just remembered yes, this bit. Did, this is gonna be fun. This is gonna be fun, because I can him. rip Yes. I can rip this quite, game's easy, fucking right? lore, given my theory, to it would seem fucking that the pieces. Task of instructing you three falls upon my shoulders. You have a perilous journey ahead of you. You must be well prepared. <laughs> they you couldn't mean, have just blurred we have to go on quest? all these characters when, and whatnot when they're supposed Riku, to be out of focus so we and not to the multiply yes, I the, know. the the particular However, person in, in your journey, that, that's supposed to be out of focus connected. and just Whether layer them on each other in varying in opacity whether you will return alone or with your friend and whether or not the islands will still be there Hey, he's got a good point. And the key that connects them all is you, Sora. I'm the key? Chosen wielder of the Keyblade, you are the key that will open the door to light. You know, this scene is kind of cinematically intense because it's like, oh, chosen wielder of the Keyblade. It feels so powerful. And then you have Donald and Goofy here just yucking it up. This book contains valuable knowledge you will need for your journey. Study it carefully. Yeah, you talk about studying, but like... Once you have finished, we will speak of the enemies you will surely confront. Oh, uh, here we go. Here's where I can rip it apart. First, we shall save. And for those that want to know, I figured it out. This is from the DID Awareness Day uh, VOD that we did regarding like going through Roxas's whole story and how it relates to like DID experiences. This I don't fucking remember. This this is what we're on now. Well hello. What do you say? This book describes powerful spells. Gee, that's mighty helpful. Can't barge in. Which will you read? The beginning. Alright, I don't remember this part, but okay. Each journey gives rise to chance encounters, and each encounter brings forth a farewell. When a farewell leads to a journey, the worlds open their hearts. There are those chosen by light and those ensnared by darkness. Friends who share the same bonds, though their paths may differ. When you doubt the past trod thus far, when the hand you held is lost to you, gaze anew at the heart that once was, for all the answers are we are within. Interlude. A long dream. 
A sad farewell hanging in the air in that world between. What is reality? What is illusion? The path chosen by the young boy leads to his memories. When caught in the stream of the days and nights going past, gaze anew at your steps, for there all confusion will end. The Future Story Will the day come when this battle born of confusion will end? It is different things to different people. Can the reality be that which is hidden? The reason is mere existence. Still, memories can be believed. Be not afraid. Entrust your body to the soothing waves of your memories. By and by, your fleeting rest will be over. And everything will begin. Wait a sec, how come the Heartless are still running around? Your past endeavors did prevent an immense effusion of Heartless from the Great Darkness. Make no mistake about that. However, the Heartless are darkness made real, and darkness yet lingers in every heart. The Heartless are fewer. But while darkness exists in a single heart, it will be difficult to eliminate them. Huh? Gorge, that must mean if everybody's heart was full of light, them heartless would go away. Um, not necessarily, because if he literally just said darkness lingers in every heart, realistically speaking in this world, we know that there are some entities that are of pure light. And we know that there are some f that outside of these folks, there are not that many folks that can achieve pure light. The most notable examples being the Princess of Heart and Ericus. So, if so, Goofy is being overly optimistic in this, being like, "Oh, if everyone has light in their heart, then darkness will go away." Unfortunately, darkness is a part of life, honey. You trying to push this battle to try and make everything all nice and bright it is a futile battle my guy now it is time to speak of the enemies that you will encounter so what you're saying is that goofy is being goofy yes if <laughs> one such as you look at it look at it you can see the break in its fucking wrist Donald, look at to it. The darkness <laughs> it looks so heart. fucked. They too will become a heartless. But you know this. Yep, yep. The heartless are always lurking and ever seeking to capture new hearts. Never let your guard down. Interesting way to think about. Sorry, my brain is going into like my theory mode. Going, but going off about like how. Oh, darkness are always keeping watch, waiting for the chance to consume people's hearts through the darkness. We also know that um, darkness through... Well, we know that darkness is not only the name of an element, but the name of a presence. Um, we learn the name of the presence specifically in uh, Union Cross when we see Ventus with the Dandelions. There's a point where he talks about how he's basically bi uh, biding his time, or rather trying to uh, bide uh, the darkness as in the entity, not darkness as in the element. So we can probably deduce here that we have the darkness, the entity, with heartless that are somewhat of an extension of the entity. But how they get around, how they have their influence, is by the natural element that is darkness. And through that element is how we get other forms of heartless. However, we don't get a distinction on... Uh, actually, no, we do get a distinction. Pure blood heartless are what we know from Ansem the Wise's Files, 
um, are obviously, those are meant to be from the pure darkness, the entity of darkness. Whereas all of our emblem heartless come from the darkness in people's hearts, the element. Now then. Oh, here's the fuckers. But Let's that's go. that's just a theory. At time. A game theory. <laughs> oh, this is a little tidbit for some of the theories that I have planned because I have this ginormous theory on how Kingdom Hearts is dissociative. No. Siri! I said theory! Ya bitch! <laughs> 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 I'm trying to go off about a fucking spiel and Siri is like, you call me? <laughs> Didn't you hear me that time, you bitch? <laughs> but I have very much a multi-part theory in relation to Kingdom Hearts and how it has a lot of uh, dissociative parallels. And yeah, I'm really hoping to have that uh, begin to come out soon. It is unfortunately incredibly dense and incredibly big. I have 14 videos planned for this bitch. <laughs> if someone with a strong heart and will, be they evil or good, becomes a heartless, the empty shell they leave behind begins to act with a will of its own. I'm going to keep just breaking apart Yen Sid's words here. The empty shell that they leave behind begins to act with a will of its own. So, by this wording, we can deduce that the heartless, when darkness, the element, consumes a person's heart, leading to them becoming an emblem heartless, their quote-unquote empty shells left behind some semblance of their body or their original identity is left behind meaning that this is very much like dissociative in nature in some way because it's like when the darkness secludes one's heart one self one sense of self and destroys one's sense of humanity whatever remnant sense of humanity there was is forced to live on its own However, if humanity is, is bred from humanity, is that not still humanity? So why the fuck do these guys keep saying that nobody's are only half a goddamn heart? An empty vessel whose heart has been stolen away. Okay. A spirit that goes on even as its body fades from existence. For you see, no bodies do not truly exist at all. I just rebutted you. I just rebutted you, you ableist fucker. <laughs> nobodies do not truly exist. What? Are you trying to imply that nobodies are a fucking Schrodinger's fucking existence? Nobodies may seem to have feelings, but this is a ruse. They only pretend to have hearts. Bull, your research is rigged. Your research is bullshit. Get Ansem the Wise out of your fucking system, revoke his license, all of that shit. You must not be deceived. Nobodies. They don't exist. See, and with with the fact that I am calling out like how ableist this kind of mentality can be, if we're going to think of Heartless and Nobodies in a dissociative sense. This made all the worse because it's like Yen's like Sora was not raised with this kind of mentality. Sora was taught this mentality, this ableism, this prejudice. Now then, the being you see before you is known as a dusk. They are the most common form of nobody. But there are others. Some larger, some with frightening and unique powers. Be vigilant. On your journey, you will meet an alarming number of dusks. They will all attempt to it's do you harm. It's the guys from the Blue Song music video. <laughs> Sorry. 
Still, they are nothing but empty shells destined to return to darkness. But... The beings you see before you now are different. These powerful nobodies have formed a group called Organization 13. It commands the lesser nobodies. You see, okay, with this, I have a question. We know that Ansem, as an Ansem the Seeker of Darkness, is the only sentient and sapient heartless that we know, partly due to the influence from Master Xehanort's will. However, that is one sapient heartless in contrast to 13, technically, nobodies that are also sapient. Why is there such a higher caliber? Uh, why is there such a higher statistic of sapiens among nobodies? And why proxy then, if there is sapiens amongst nobodies, that. Yen Sid and others want to promote this idea of, oh, keep away from them, they're bad. It's like, bro, they are literally of a completely different race, forged from trauma in relation to death, and you want to pull this shit? Organization 13. While heartless act on instinct, Nobody is functioning in a higher manner. They can think and plan, and it seems they are working towards a goal. What you have that a question. goal is, I don't we do have not answers. Know. I'll still be here to call you handsome, <laughs> the king though. Thank you, Zelda. The danger and journeyed forth to fight it. He found the Dark Realm's Keyblade and with it closed the door. Now he's traveling from world to world, fighting the heartless as he seeks the answer to the riddle of the nobodies and Organization 13. Then I guess we better go find the king first. What world could he be? Well, we won't know till we look. Yeah, and the king must know where Riku is, because the two of them were together in the realm of darkness when we closed the door. No. You yeah, know, after defeating sound Hansen, logic. So, before you go, you will need more suitable traveling clothes. <laughs> Those look a bit too small for you. Through there, you'll find three good fairies. If you ask, they'll the create for you appropriate, appropriate garments. Gore, Sora, you sure are growing fast. Yeah, Fucker had a growth uh, spurt. I guess. Fucker ha <laughs> Fucker had a growth spurt and his balls dropped. How does that feel? Like... Like, okay, no, his balls dropped in Chain of Memories. But like, how does it feel to wake up and suddenly be like, I'm taller. My clothes don't fit anymore. How the fuck does that feel? That's like being in a coma almost. Also, give me a hot minute while this. Me, you guys, here. Riku and the King. I don't care who this organization is or what it's planning. With the five of us, I mean, six of us, there's nothing to worry about, right? Yeah. Okay. I forgot how short that cutscene actually was because I was anticipating. For a moment there, I thought you were asking how it feels <laughs> for your balls to drop, and I was like, "Road, I don't think we can talk about that." No, 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 no. Well, oh wait, I probably. Here, dears, Sora, Donald, Buck, and I Goofy. probably forgot to look around well, for some if chests. You're looking for clothes. You've come to the right place. I'll do the designing. These three are so sweet, though. 
Also, let's be honest, they stole the show in the original Sleeping Beauty movie. Like, no, sure, Prince Philip did it. all the stabby stab, but they oh, gave him all of the means. But don't you like this better? Hold on. Are you so <laughs> blue? I love how you see, like, a little bit of recoil from him every time that he's hit with the magic. Ah, would you just decide? <gasps> Why not all of them? All right, then. Together now, dears. And no more squabbling. Yay, let's go. Oh, my. Oh, it's lovely. Ah, I love oh, Sora's theme. Yes. He does look very dashing. Now those aren't ordinary garments. They have very special powers. I used to have a really good uh, Sora cosplay. Take the orb, dear. Unfortunately, I grew out of it. <laughs> and watch what happens. Wow. Whoa! Whoa! He can dual wield! Wow. Two keyblades! This journey's going to be twice as difficult as your last. <laughs> your garments also have other powers. But you'll have to discover what they are as you continue on your journey. Okay, I'll do my best, and thanks a lot. Oh, and there's something else for you from Master Yen Sid. Oh yeah, our ship! Oh boy! Valor. Okay, yes, I can still look around. Yay! Okay. An imagery of you obtaining old powers. Imagery utilizing your strength to its fullest. An image of you utilizing your magic to its fullest. An image of you possessing all abilities. An image of the Keyblade unleashing its ultimate power. An image of you overcome by the power of darkness. Oh! <laughs> Also, yes, in preparation for a special stream that we're going to have on, on an alternate platform at the end of the month, uh, we are taking submissions for uh, uh, for a Q&A. Feel free to check the link. Huh? Sora? I think you dropped something. Huh? It must have fallen out of your pocket. What is it? Part of a picture? Is this a gift, too? Oh, we don't know anything about that, but if you found it in your yes. pocket, it must have something to do with your adventure. Hold on to it, dear. In fact, you should hold on to any other pieces you come across on your journey. I'll make sure to note them in my journal. A puzzle piece. Puzzle pieces are scattered all over the world. Some can only be accessed after learning a certain ability. I did not remember that in, King in the first version of Kingdom Hearts 2. Let's go. Hey, it's the gummy ship. So you guys ready to go? <laughs> now, now, just a moment. <laughs> because of your previous endeavors, the worlds These have returned, returned to, to their, their original states. states. That means the pathways between them have disappeared. How do we get around? Fuck around do and find fear. out. If what the king suspected proves true, the worlds have prepared new pathways along which you may travel. These pathways may be utilized by unlocking special gates. 
How these gates are opened, I'm afraid I do not know. However, the Keyblade will serve as your guide. You know, when I will say this. When we Keyblade, get to like the, to the, the FMV ship. little parts of these cutscenes, the like this where we get like larger um, accents on the lip sync, I have to eyes. say the voice actor for Yen Sid as actually hits a lot of the our key spots for the lip reading. That is correct. Like spot yeah. on. But be warned, as you proceed, the Heartless and the Nobodies will be using their own paths, corridors of darkness to travel from world to world. They may be attempting to link these dark pathways to the gates between the worlds. How does that feel? Now then. That is all the information I can give to you. Go forth, Sora, Donald, and Goofy. Everyone is waiting. Okay, let's get going. Master Lutzen! <laughs> we sure do appreciate the help. Nice. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. My goodness, what's that? Maleficent's back, bitches! Bring home the mistress of all evil. Let's fucking go. Come at me, girly. Haven't we seen this somewhere before? Yes, dear. I wonder whose it was. Oh, Malefa! No, we mustn't remember her name. Oh, dear. She was a mean old witch. Oh no, the memories are coming back. What'll we do? Oh, what'll we do? Oh! I love it with like the slightly higher quality of stuff. For this version, like you can really see the warping of the cloak like that. It's almost like body horror. Oh. God, I love her cloak. <laughs> Howdy, Sora. How you doing? It's your favorite dummy engineers here, ready for duty. Chip and Dale. Happy flying! Nice. Only one? That's no good. Wait, I think it's a world we know. Yes, it is indeed. It is Hollow Bastion. <laughs> Maleficent! Maleficent! Gotta love Pete. Absolute dumbass. Maybe they really did finish her off. Ooh, this castle sure ain't what I expected. No shine, no nothing. <laughs> oh, now what's gonna happen to our plan? It's Hollow Bastion. Gorge looks kind of different now. You know, I will say this when it comes to Hollow Bastion. I will always love its original song. Namely because Yoko, Yoko Shimomura, wrote the original theme for Hollow Bastion in 5 4. If I remember right, this is 4 4. 
One, two, three, four, one. Okay, at least the intro is four, four. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Okay. I just had that intro there that's in 4-4 four, four, and the rest is in 5-4. Nice! Oh, that extra flipping set of drums threw me off. We'll put that on him. able to change their AI? Okay. Thought I was still able to, but I guess not. Oh, I need to get these. Uh, who needs it more? Staff used for strength, a shield that excels in defense rather than strength. about all the other ones later. Moogle! Talk to Moogles in towns that can synthesize items and various materials. Collect the materials used for item synthesis to create various items. I'll talk to you later. Scrooge! Hello, David Tennant. <laughs> uh, who? He's Donald's uncle, a business typhoon. Before the Heartless showed up, he traveled the worlds on a gummy ship with the king. He was helping to set up a traffic system. A transit system. What's all the racket? Why, if it isn't Donald. And Goofy, hello lads. Ah, you all look hale and hearty. So do you, Uncle Scrooge. Ah, if only I were. I kind of seem to recreate my favorite old-time ice cream. I'd make millions if I could just get it right. Terrible. That is my attempt at a Scottish accent. It's more Irish, but fuck it. <laughs> my ice looks like it can make good ice cream. Oh, the security system. Hey, what's going on? That's the town's defense mechanism. Yuffie! Yuffie! Look out! Wait, she got an eye color change. I don't remember her eyes being that color originally. I think they were brown. Now they're like this nice burgundy. Aww. Yeah. Just like my eye color. Ah. How is this fucker so beefy? There we go. You're still in top form. What'd you expect? Looks like you're doing okay. Well, what did you expect? I want the others. Oh, I love how like the hey, newer Yuffie, versions of these models 
helps to really nope. accentuate the extra colors that are in everyone's color palettes. Like Yuffie's, but I had a like it's not I'd just these cool grays and blacks. It's also that that we nice never meet khaki. Again, but we'll never forget each other. Is that supposed to be Leon? <laughs> Everybody's working on stuff over at Merlin's house. Come on. Did she always have a decal on her shirt like that? I would have to look at her original uh, low poly model from Kingdom Hearts 2 to see if she originally had that decal on her top. Because I'm curious. I'm legit curious. Let's go see the buddies. And Sid is... Sid just looks like a baby, like, like the mashing Bastion there. He's not even, like, committee. typing. We missed you. Well, if you ain't in top shape, I knew it. Knew what? A while back, everyone suddenly remembered you guys, all at the same time. You remembered? Wait, does that mean you forgot about us? Yes, Sora. Because you were asleep and in, a, and in a world that was fucking up with your memories and by proxy was forgetting what was making everyone else forget about you. Your existence was this close to being wiped off of the face of the cosmos. Ouch. So where have you guys been all this time? We were sleeping. Where? In cold storage? Yes, Sid. Yes. It doesn't matter. <laughs> this is great. Everyone's together again. So, um, we're trying to find Riku and the king. Have you seen him? Right. Sorry, but let us know if there's anything we can do to help, okay? Okay, thanks. Don't go thanking us just yet. Hollow Bastion's got a problem. A big problem. You mean like nobodies and heartless? That's right. Sounds like you could use our help. Then let's cut to the chase. What? Fair point, Leon. Sora, Donald, Goofy. We were hoping the three of you might give us a oh! Pyro Ashes, like thank you so no. much for the uh, for the raid. Let me get a shout out for you, I super quick. Who I'm dealing with. Welcome raiders. Oh, what do you mean by that? Pyro, looks like you were doing sort of art. Nice. What were you drawing? B, for those that are hopping in that may not know what we do around here, this is the Road to Dusk. You can call me Road Dusk. Follow and me to the bailey. A friend. There's something you I'm need a dream hunter, so I focus on sleep, dreams, and the imagination to create an environment where people can be better versions of themselves. Uh, we are currently oh, playing one of my absolute favorite comfort right games, Kingdom Hearts 2, as I am hoping to want to try and be able to stream every single Sora, game in the, the series, probably out. save for Union Bending. Cross, just because obviously the servers are already down. Right. Right. Nor am I sure that ah, I will do yes. Dark Road, but at the very least here. I will do all console oh. games. But we do not just retro games around yeah. here. We also do indie I games. I was sketching some tattoo concepts for tomorrow's like to Flash them. Tattoos for a cause Ooh. to get done on me and doing a Minecraft fan art redeem. Nice! Well, Follow fingers crossed that everything goes well for you, Pyro. Honorary member. But yeah, not only do we do <laughs> games like this, we also do Coin indie games, cool. and we oh. also like to dabble with some art hey, thanks, and Leah. some VR. Huh? If you want to become part of the community of and keep up with any details oh, no. feel free We're to check to out my car family. which includes links to all of my socials including two youtube channels one for vod archives one for video essays um yeah there is also a link in there for my official discord in collaboration with uh my partner system aka never the, the nuclear clan aka never lost Noctis. Uh, do you know that when you hop in, you have 15 minutes to verify that you have read the rules, otherwise you will be temporarily booted by one of the bots meant to curb against hate, reads, and trolls? 
do know that, like my streams, my community is 18+, plus. we are LGBTQI2 Spirit+, plus, neurodivergent, disability, disability, and mental health forward, and we also do our best to be uplifting and advocative for by uh, for black voices regarding their own experience. If any of that is of interest to you, please feel free to Got stick around, I very much appreciate the, the therapist company. last week. Had a personality start fronting recently, and it's been something I have had to come oh. to terms with for a while. I just didn't want to accept it for a while. No, that's completely understandable. Um, I didn't know that I was part of the system. Me, Road, until literally Yule of 2020. So the Winter Solstice of 2020. During lockdown, so that was fun. But yeah, it can be... You're allowed to be scared when it comes to finding that an alter or a headmate has started fronting or forming things like that. There's a lot of stigma around it, so it made me scared to come to terms with it. Oh, no, I get you. Uh, we have a late family me member who is kind of ostracized yeah. or being dissociative, um, so we get that that stigma and that shame. Like, we understand um, that we understand the fear of like exacerbating it in some way. But give yourself time and patience. Give all of yourself time and patience. Give yourself time to process everything. And when you feel like everything has been processed, then you can start working on a course of action on do you want to reach healthy multiplicity? Uh, do you want to reach for a final fusion? How you go about processing uh, your that your diagnosis and subsequently potentially your trauma or whatever you need to focus on is completely up to you. If your therapist or any um, medical professional says that you have to do a final fusion, that's not the case. Within the past 20 so years... So far I know of the one yeah. personality, they are younger and more of a child with lots of questions named mm -hmm. Moth, but they're not harmful. Therapist says that as long as Look the personality isn't causing harm, then it's okay to have D.I.D. Dot dot yes. Yeah, no. It, while there oh. are uh, harmful headmates and alters, those have a be. subcategory called hostels. At the same time, better. like to assume that There's all uh, that all alters sure are going to be hostile or that Except people need to be scared of those with DID because that. of hostels is a In massive hypergeneralization. We have, we've actually had to recount because we've been dealing with a lot of micro traumas and such. Well, and with us being autistic, actually well, makes us more hear. susceptible. So, Sora, um, do you know what's going on then? Because recent study guy, had found Pete, that autistics actually um, have a. But. He's not uh, I'm trying to figure out how to phrase this, shoes. but it kind of uh, came out with evidence nobodies. that autistics Ambo's tend to have a much lower threshold on what you is called? considered a uh, a good experience and what is a, what is considered a traumatic experience. And because of that, um, it you might be possible well. that there is a higher uh, amount of folks that are autistic that also happen to be dissociative, whether they're the point of headmates or not. Um, I know that there is, that at least when it comes to my and my system's uh, inner circle, the vast majority, if not the entirety of those that we know who are dissociative are also autistic. So, make of that what you will. Oh. No, we fill you with that. Autistic, ADHD, complex PTSD, depression, anxiety, and then yeah. dissociative disorder. So we get it to some extent. Frankly, like, obviously everyone's experiences are going to be unique. All of those same for me. Yeah. No, don't you! There we go. Oh. 
Also led to a bit of an existential crisis for me that led to me kind of opening the door weapon. to others of my system. And only in more obviously, I'm here today. Hands. <laughs> <laughs> Show yourselves. song it is eerie it is foreboding but it's also just almost like a lullaby i legit slept to this Good. now we can settle this what a shame and here i thought we could be friends <laughs> also i have this bad amazing organization 13 code for cosplay but i grew out of it because i am I have become a bear, IRL. What's the big idea? Oopsie Daisy. Move! Now, do you think that's polite? Shutting me down like that? <laughs> I said get out of the way! As if. You can talk all you want, but that won't I did a first a at the convention today. <gasps> I've cosplayed over that 14 me? years. Nice! Oh, no, no, no. That is awesome! See, that would work, if... I'm curious about your persona now. Dude. Except I'm not. I'm with the organization. Nothing any old about me. Huh. Tough talk for someone who stood on the sidelines while his nobody flunkies did the fighting. I'll post it oh in the dear. Discord, lol. Yee -yee. I think you got the wrong impression. You gonna cry? As if. Why don't I remind you how tough the crowd you're dealing with really is? Here you is. go, if you need a link remind for the me. Discord, uh, just in case you couldn't find it in the card. <laughs> That's right! You used to give me that same exact look! I guess you think you can psych me out by saying really random stuff. Gee, I just don't know. Be a good boy now. <laughs> I'm in the Discord. I just am yes, not very active. Oh, face. okay. That was weird. Who gave him the same look? You know, I think he was just trying to confuse you. Yeah, <laughs> you're right. Only one me. So you think, Sora. So you think. The Hollow Bastion well, Restoration yes, Committee you, Honorary Member. Plenty more of you to go around. <laughs> wow. Huh? What's this? Gorge, you think? Here's the ticket. Also, Pyro, I think you missed me going on a tangent. Regarding how Yen said talked about nobody's been heartless to Sora. Because I and my system have a massive theory in relation to Kingdom Hearts being dissociative coded. And because of that, I have been dissecting every piece 
of what people say. It was Diz the first time, uh, during the first um, time that we played Kingdom Hearts 2, going through oh, Roxas's I get uh, route. And now here with Yen Sid. That must have been the gate Yen Sid talked about. Like, I swear, the Sorry whole dynamic that you have with Sora and Roxas alone are calling. is incredibly dissociative coded in and of Organization itself. 13. They look tough. Be careful out there. See you soon. Ooh. Final mix cutscene. Do my eyes deceive me? Does he really have the power to wield the keyblade? Not sure where he's to post the heart of my son. Oh, uh, let's chance. see. It means he's straight as an arrow. He's pure of heart. Unlike all of um, us here. You should be able to... Oh, he himself is good, actually. Or else he's worthless. I truly hope he's enjoying himself on his adventure. <laughs> Maybe he'd like a hand to determine his fate. Hey, as long as it works in our favor... We can let him do what he wants for now. Then we'll all jump in if needed. Those are bold words coming from you. Are okay, you saying okay. you'll volunteer to take care of it if things go wrong? Also, I um, love your plushie. What? <laughs> Me? No, you have the wrong guy. I'm not comfortable with that. <laughs> you act as though you have a conscience. When was the last time any one of us felt anything? Truer words were never spoken. <laughs> Well, I suppose the fun will have to wait. Do you know what happens to those who lose their true purpose? Inevitably, they destroy themselves. Gentlemen. The hero of the Keyblade has embarked on a new adventure. Make sure it is one he will remember. Way to be foreboding. Now go. Wow, the fact that so many members of the organization are just gone. The badge art was also posted for reference. Ooh. Smiley face. Nice, nice. Oh, that's adorable. Use the left stick to fight a gummy ship tribe for the door. Yee! I figured with like the ears being so big, but that's awesome. Actually, you know what? We'll do Beast Castle first. I'm not editing the gummy ship. We'll just do the high wind. Best of luck. I am going to try to rest. Yee! You get some good rest. Thank you for stopping by. Left stick, press X to fire. This sure is exciting. I can press and hold, right? Ah, uh, full auto. I'm used to the PS2 controls where they're inverted. Ah, 
I love the melody of this. about that. What is this place? It's huge! And sort of gloomy, don't you think? I wonder who lives here. <laughs> <laughs> well, that gives you an answer. Hey, does anybody else recognize that? Hey, that's the beast! Yeah. Maybe we should check up on him. Look! Ah, oh, here we go. Come on. You know, I love how like PS2 era games and before really show just how much what we consider like quality when it comes to graphics is more so in relation to the textures than the polygons. We tend to go off now and be like, oh, it's so innovative. We can do all these polygons and make shit so realistic. But it's like, do we not give any love to, say, the folks that create the textures for these? Because, like, goddamn, come on. Like, it, it's no better than how, like, you have the cast and the crew for a theater. You have the director or the game dev and game designer you have the cast, which is obviously your, but which is kind of like your main developers, like who are making the assets. But then you have the costume designers, which are your textures. You have the orchestra, which is obviously your music creators and your singers. There's so many parallels in relation to like theater and art and game creation that I feel tends to be uh, that tends to be overlooked when it comes to the whole debate of graphics over like graphics over whatever because like yes graphics are pretty having higher poly and more realistic shit yeah it's cool do I care for it not really 
like, cool, it's a nice little animation. However, we can get just as good a quality, if not better, by just upping the quality of our textures. We don't need constantly super high poly kind of models in order to accentuate, in order to support these higher quality textures. I mean, come on, the PS1 era heavily relied on high texture, on high quality textures and high detail textures to counter for the fact that they had such low time. poly the flipping low poly models. This isn't a new thing. It's an aspect of game creation that has been going on for a good while, using the assets and the limitations of your generation to its fullest. Gee, do you think mm -hmm. he maybe forgot who we are? With this many heartless around, something must be up. Why do you have to do that? <laughs> you deserved it, Donald. I don't think we have anything for synthesis at the moment. Yeah. Yeah, we have nothing to synthesize. Well, next to nothing, rather. What's that? Or what is it? I just know I saw a lady at the top of those stairs. Well, if the beast is here in the castle, that lady must have been Belle, right? Yeah, maybe so. Belle might know what's happened to the beast, too. Come on, let's go find her! Fucking dodge roll. Shh. Go on. Oh, what am I going to do? Oh, town. What? Donald. <laughs> Yes, breaking and entering. That's a perfect idea, Donald. Oh, I'm so happy you're here. Donald. <laughs> Sora. Goofy. Hiya. Oh. <laughs> Where's the beast? Oh, he must be in the West Wing. We don't talk like we used to. Did something happen? Yeah. Isn't that why you're here? <laughs> Not exactly, but we can still help. Since we're here and all. The beast won't talk to you? He's been acting strange lately. The only ones who might know why are locked up in the dungeon. I want to help them, but... Wait a second, who locked who up? The beast locked up his servants. But why? That's what I don't know. Huh. Where is this dungeon? You can get to the Undercroft from the West Hall. The dungeon is down there. West Hall, got it. Be careful. Uh... 
Let's just open up these. I wonder if we'll get to Zelda. I hope we can get to Zelda before streams end. Has there been anyone that's tried to do a driveless speed run? Like a driveless any percent? Of Kingdom Hearts 2. Because that would be sick. <sighs> there should be... So there should be a way into the Undercroft around here. <laughs> here it is. Do you mind? <laughs> And I was just starting to get comfortable. Thank you for the full care package. I actually have some uh, snackies right here that I can snag. May I help you? Huh? Self-care jump scare. <laughs> Thank you, Zelda. Super appreciate it. Oh, right. Elle needs us to go to the dungeon. Goodness, you are here to help my friends. Well, why didn't you so say so? Um, I'm sorry I startled you. Oh, I used to be human, you know, until the Enchantress cast her spell. I was turned into a wardrobe when the prince was turned into a beast. The prince is the beast? The beast is the prince? That's right. Although his behavior was far from princely at the time. What's this about a spell? Well, it was a cold winter's night. And that's enough for now. You can hear the rest when you rescue the others. Floor. The floor is made of floor. <laughs> Let me grab... I'll just randomly grab one. Oh, great flavor. Sorry, I have these uh, Japanese candies, soda kids, and each little candy is individually wrapped, which is super neat because there's like seven flavors in here, with one of them being rare. Um, so we have orange soda, grape soda, peach soda, lemon soda, ramune, and uh, cola with a special, uh, with a special rare um, cream soda flavored, so, which all of these just taste amazing. For those who want to look it up, soda kids. Soda Seven flavors kids. of candy, and yet none of them are as sweet as you. <laughs> ah, I almost croaked on that. <laughs> if you had to put me down for a flavor or flavor combo, what would it be? Hurry now, the sunshine is damp and chilly. 
Certainly no place for a clock. A clock? You'll find out soon enough. All right, let's get going. Thinking, my only weakness. <laughs> This must be it. Oh, I need to read these. Come on, we gotta set those servants free! He's right, let's go. Um, there weren't any... chests. Growth is a flavor. Hmm, I'd say most likely something fruity, just not sure what. Well, I mean, I do love a lot of citrusy stuff. Great, now I'm fucking hearing someone say fucking There's pina colada. You mean there's no one to rescue? <sighs> Did someone say rescue? Oh. Shh, keep quiet. It might be what? them. <laughs> oh, they look like nice boys to me. We are nice. We're your friends. Yeah, Bell sent us to find yeah, you. Yeah, just saying, oh yeah, we're friends, trust us. Wow. Mm. I'm Sora. Donald. Goofy. I am self-winding, sir. I am not goofy. I'm glad you're okay. <laughs> it is we who are overjoyed to see you. Did somebody put a spell on you guys, too? Yes, that's right. You've heard. It was the Enchantress. It seems so long ago. It was a cold <laughs> winter's night. An old beggar woman came to the castle and asked for shelter. But the master of this castle, that is, of course, the prince. Stop that! Put me down this instant! That's what you do for not respecting boundaries, Donald. Uh, hmm. 
the master turned her the, the master turned her away. All because of her <laughs> meager appearance. That's awful. We I I'm not sure if I can do a French accent. We oui, he was he was a spoiled prince. I, no, I'm not going to do it. So selfish and how shall I say cruel. Lumiere! The old woman warned our master not to be deceived by appearances. Still, he would not take her in. Then, the old woman's ugliness melted away to reveal a beautiful enchantress. She turned the prince into a beast, a shape she thought fitting for his cold heart. And to further punish him, everyone in the castle was enchanted too. Wow, that's quite a story. Is there anything we can do to help? Let's get the Enchantress! Oh no, dear! We already know what needs to be done, but with the Master out of sorts... He sure is acting weird. It's almost as if he's forgotten how to trust others. You don't suppose he's been turned into a Heartless, do you? A Heartless? If they were a part of this, then it's a good thing we're here. Let's go find the beast. Splendid! Follow me, messieurs. I know a shortcut. Okay. Let's do another save. Allow our guests to pass. I don't know why, but <laughs> looking at your model is making me think of blueberry cheesecake. Blueberry cheesecake? Ooh, that actually sounds nice. All right. How do we get out of here? I'm afraid we won't be marching out that easily. You see, the door leading to the other side is concealed by a sort of contraption. What kind of contraption? Observe. The lantern came down. Indeed it did. If we could but light all the lanterns in this passage, the secret door would open. But as you can see, the lanterns are already burning with an enchanted flame. You must put out this enchanted flame before I am able to light the lanterns properly. Can't you just throw some water on them? I'm afraid that's not enough. But if you use power of light. Huh. How about I try using the keyblade? Bravo! Approach each lantern using the reaction command sprinkle for the out. Only three lanterns left. If we work together, we'll have that door open in no time. Piece of cake. Again, it is not quite so simple, Monami. Certainly you cannot expect Cogsworth to hang from that handle forever. What? Why? Lumiere! You! If he gets tired and falls off, all the unlit lanterns will rise to the ceiling again. Before you can continue, you must see the Cogs Cogsworth. Once he gets his strength back, he'll grasp the lever again for you. Let's give it a shot. Get over here. There we go.
Come on, get over here. All of you. Now I'm hungry for cheesecake. <laughs> cheesecake sounds amazing. I actually have some ice cream in the freezer that I could grab. Though, oh, I know that there's like cheesecake flavored ice cream and there's ice cream. Which sounds amazing. Just all of this sounds good. This is Pots! I think this will be the trick. Please pray and be quick about it. I would if I could, but I don't have my dodge roll. Get him up again after this. Yeah, no, he's too weak. Okay. So you stuck with him. That's good. No, 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 no. Quick about it. Oh, here she comes. Come on, girly. This is Pots. Come on. Oh, let's go. Are we all set? The secret door should open now. But I don't see any secret door. No need to worry. Just push that block over there. The one that's sticking out. Got it. Now I must check on the castle. I fear my absence has been too long. I'd best be off too, dears. Watch out for Heartless. The master's room is at the very end of the west wing. I shall go on ahead and wait for you. Oh, I just thought of an amazing <laughs> parallel! Fucking Cogsworth is to the beast as Strax is to... <laughs> is for the doctor and his friends for, from Doctor Who. Tell me I have dodge roll. Tell me I have dodge roll. Why do I not have dodge roll? Oh. Oh, this is annoying. Those will all have to check later. Haha! Come here, fuckers. Ah! Oh, 
Tommy Wallace. Let me get him. And this is a message in chat. Gonna <laughs> snag this real quick. There we go. dealt with Bell. She's scheming to take everything you have. This castle, your precious rose, and then your life. Trust no one. Feed your anger. Only anger will keep you strong. I've had enough of strength. There's only one thing I want. What? <laughs> Love and be loved in return. Who could ever love a beast? See, she has accomplices. Hey, Prince. Happy is anger. Oh, I think Mr. Bad Guy is a Sith Lord. <laughs> Quite possibly. Remember this part of Beauty and the Beast. <laughs> Must be a deleted scene or something. Sure seems so. Cogsworth, what happened? Let's well, be honest. Master, if they uh, made a see, movie that is, how I out say? of this uh, plot line actually, um, for Beauty and the Beast as like a sequel movie, wow, it still bro, would be better. The Bell's Enchanted Christmas and win. Bell's Enchanted Tales. Yeah, you did. Who was that guy you were talking to? The one in black. <gasps> Zaldan. <sighs> That's his name. He came from the darkness. <laughs> he used my anger to control me. He took all my sorrow. My sadness, my pain, and turned it all into rage. There was nothing I could do. I could no longer see the truth. Well, all be. That must be why you threw all of your friends down there into the dungeon. You wanted to make sure that you didn't hurt them, right? Aww. Was that it? Was it to protect them? Sure. We know you're good inside. He's right. See, yeah, I so love how Goofy is. How Palpatine how returned. Wait, wrong series. <laughs> I love how They're everyone is trying to reassure the Beast heart, here, because it's like, imagine that you were in the Beast shoes, like uh, you kind of lost yourself. Uh, For lack of better analogy, her. he was kind of coerced into so selfish. She didn't say a manipulative, uh, a manipulated mindset. She'd never tell anyone of my cruelty. She's too good. You see, I'm afraid he judges himself far too harshly. Why don't you just He's go talk to He's the one that her? got cursed and made everyone else in the castle get cursed in but turn. 
while no it's excuses. sad, Cogsworth, we'll at the same time, you. can you not understand where and how he got his perspective? Like, damn. Oh wait, worry about those later. Since Donald is a lot better in this game than Kingdom Hearts 1, I'll leave Donald in my party. E 20 minutes before the end of stream. I, th I think we'll actually get to Zelda. Beast, move! <laughs> Hi, buddy. Just... He just... I cannot even describe this. He's like a fucking train rushing into a fucking impact. Pull him up, pull him up. and extremely cute. Thank you, Zelda. I seriously appreciate it. That's super sweet. <laughs> I forget. Is she in the ballroom yet? But yeah, it has to be the ballroom first, because then it's that, uh, it's the Heartless on the Chandelier before we get to Zelda. If I'm remembering correctly. If I am remembering correctly, right. not if I remember it long time since I last saw you. I hope your game is going well. I can't hey. stay for long, so goodbye. Thank you for hopping in, me. Really hope that you're doing well. Thank you for hopping in, but also especially thank you for focusing on yourself and doing what you need to do. Yee, we're getting close to the end of stream in about 15 minutes, but that's not going to stop me from trying to finish this world before the end of the night. Now, if only I had... Can't forget to remind all of the other members of the Terra Ball system that they're also <laughs> all amazing, wonderful, lovely, adorable, and cute. Really appreciate it, Zelda. Thank you, genuinely. There we go. But um, I'm hoping to finish through the finish through this world by the end of the night. Which does mean that since we are close to the end of stream, if there's anyone that you want us to raid out to, feel free to use the guide the raid uh, point redeem. Okay, she's not in here. So do I need to just go back? I was not fully paying attention to the conversation and the dialogue earlier, so I don't remember if we need to just go back. 
her. Oh wait, yeah, because fucking Zaldin nabbed her. Woo! Fucker came right for me. Everybody's safe now. Wonderful, thank you. Where's Belle? Why? She left in a hurry. Something about going after this man in black. What? Why doesn't she do as she's told? Temper, temper. Her spirit is what makes Belle so special. We better go find her. Don't have a whole whole lot of time. You'll be sorry. Belle, where are you? Thieves, help! I'm in the ballroom. Oh, fuck off! Here we go. Belle. I'm all right. Here's now, the fucker. Has he searched the church tower? <laughs> this fucker. I want this fucker made onto like one of those. You know, like one of those like uh, paddle ball toys that have like the to the ball connected by a string. I want this heartless, but on a paddle ball. <laughs> Tell me he wouldn't look cool as a paddle ball! Aw, oh, fuck, 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 fuck! Woo! Get out! Light! I wasn't close enough. Yeah. This corner in. Ah, oh, damn it! No! No! He's in the floors! No! Get to the center. Right, let's go for the one that he is stuck in. Exercise his ass. No, 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 no. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> All right, phase one. I always loved this heartless as a kid because I this was the first time that uh, my sister and I ever dealt with multi-phase enemies. So seeing this guy has a second phase, intimidated, but but excited the ever-living shit out of us. Woo! 
ですよ So you hit. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, where'd you go? Where'd you go? Oh. That's what happens when I don't do it in time. I see. Step ball. There we go. Get him, get him, get him. This is slow. Like, that was a weird frame drop. I'm pretty sure it was meant to be purposeful and cinematic, but... Huh. We did it! So you think. Zaldan! There he is. Yeah. <sighs> What does he want here? He must be with Organization 13. <sighs> Ever heard of the Nobodies? When a strong-hearted person turns into a heartless, a Nobody is created too. See, the Organization, they've got control of all the Nobodies. That's right! And they were gonna make you into a heartless. That way they could get that Nobody of yours and have control over it. You're all right! <laughs> Bell! Sorry, I... I wasn't myself. I hope I haven't done anything to hurt you. Forgive me. I know you weren't yourself. You don't have to apologize. Oh. But I had hoped that you might have changed a little bit. I oh. wish you could start trusting me. I am afraid time is running short. What do you mean? Remember the rose? <laughs> Trap the beast, Rob. Precisely. You see, if the master can learn to love and earn love in return before the last petal falls, the spell will be broken. Really? You think he's gonna make it? We think so. Oh. Yup, I think you're right. I hope you're right. Oh. Oh, did we go against Zelda another time?
Yeah, because, okay, yeah, that makes sense because we always go to worlds multiple times. Okay! I thought that we were going to have to go against Zaldin immediately, but I guess not. I love this kind of take, though, for Kingdom Hearts 2, like how certain important items become beacons to the keyhole, as opposed to the, as opposed to the keyhole being hidden in plain sight. What happened? The gate is open! Do you have to go? Yeah. Well, no more arguing, okay? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> we'll see to it. Take care, dears. You are welcome here any time. If you hear anything about Riku, or the King, the Heartless, the organization, anything at all, let us know. Okay, gotta go. <laughs> Nice. Cure element. Nice. That's gonna be helpful. You know what? Let's go through both of these doors for the rest of the stream. Yeah, we'll go through these last two doors and we'll call that for tonight. While this is doing its own little animation, let me see who we can read on to. highest rank that you can get in this. Because I want to get it. That is a pretty emblem. Hey, yo. Oh, oh. Good going, Zora. All right.
Sorry, let me double check a thing. Alright, so I think we're only able to get through one. But... Ah, uh, let's see. Trying to see who we might want to raid out to. Because there's a few folks. I would like to try and branch out of my little circle, though. Why does its spaceship look like it was made out of Legos? It <laughs> kind of does, honestly. Uh, let's see. I think I know who we might uh, go out to. I see someone who is playing their very first playthrough of Final Fantasy X. So... Yeah, you know what? Uh, please. Let me double check to see if... They're good. Yes, and they are actually a lot more professional than I am. So we are going out to a special friendo. Well, not friendo yet, but we'll see what happens. Anyway, before we do that, let's uh, get the raid Thanks message the out. You, yeah, be sure to stick around for the uh, for raiding out. So here's the version for passersby. Here's the version for followers. So, let's go give some support over to a very popular streamer, Hana, who is, as I said, playing their first playthrough of Final Fantasy X. Looks to be on original hardware, too, not a remaster. So, let's raid over and spread over some love and support. Do you know that while this is the end of stream, this is not the end of our time together, as the road to desk will always be open for another adventure. Thank you all so, so much for sticking around. Please have a wonderful rest of your morning, afternoon, evening, whatever time it is in your time zone, as we say. Bye bye